If you read the New Testament in Hebrew, it says Hapa Nagila. Okay, right? My God. And our people, most of our people don't know that those words are in the New Testament, but they're going to find out. They're going to know that. Um, and so we sing, we can celebrate with that song. Uh, we don't have to wait to go to somebody's wedding because we, uh, we have a foretaste of the wedding supper of the Lamb. The Lord is preparing us for this wonderful celebration. I love these people here. They're from Celebration Church. What a great name. Hallelujah. We should all be the Celebration Church, right? Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Um, Praise God. We have this this foretaste of the new wine of the kingdom. This is this is the joy of the Spirit. The Lord says, um, Ephesians 1 13 says that we are sealed with the Holy Spirit of promise. Hallelujah. And the Holy Spirit is what releases the joy of the Lord within us. Uh, we're going to talk to more about that because the joy of the Lord is a very, very key element in victory and walking in victory the in, these, the place, in these days. The the eyes, the but the, the intimate bridal relationship with the Lord Yield is really the Lord. foundational Yield to anything to that we are going to be, Yield that the Lord has called us to, to be released into uh, those works that the Lord has ordained before the, the foundation of the earth for each of us. Um, it begins with that intimacy of the Lord. Um, I know my husband, uh, David, told us, uh, told you a little bit about my testimony. He does a great job. He's heard it so many times. <laughs> but I, I'll fill in maybe a couple more, more of the details. Um, I was raised in a Jewish family in the United States. And um, I used to go, you know, we went to the synagogue every Shabbat, um, you know, for years. And we celebrated all the holidays. But I, I never experienced the reality of God in, in the synagogue. And yet, I, you know, I was raised in music, and I was very sensitive to nature and beauty, and I knew there had to be some kind of creative force be behind this, and 